friends, Miss Me states, a quick question for you. What do you get when you play with alcohol inks and some plastic wrap? Answer, a really cool looking vase. Let's go to the table and we'll get started. So we're gonna go ahead and take our saran wrap, lay it on our surface. The idea here is you're going to apply the alcohol ink to this and then wrap it around your item. Okay, as so I have that, let's go ahead and grab some colors. So I have botanical, this is a green color, and you want to make sure your saran wrap is fully covered the best. You know, it doesn't have to be fully covered but we're not adding any kind of um, alcohol or blending solution. We're just gonna let the alcohol do its thing, the alcohol ink. Let's take some purple. You definitely wanna have your windows open and your fan going because it is a strong smell of alcohol if that bothers you. Or even if it doesn't bother you, it's not good to inhale it. So definitely have the windows open. All right, so now we have some orange going. I need some blue in here. It's really cool. I mean, the nice thing with alcohol things, you can just play all day long and you create different, all, all different kinds of things. There's no mistakes, I think, with alcohol ink. And I'm very, very new to alcohol ink. I just started playing with it. All right, so now, we have that going, we're gonna take our vase and we're gonna wrap around. And I'm not pushing, and you know, the part that does not have alcohol ink on, I'm just gonna kinda of smush it down. I'm gonna fold this under, bring this piece over this side of my saran wrap, if I can grab it. And it may not go, yeah, see it's not going all the way across, so I'll just Grab some more saran wrap. Pick this piece up. Okay, I'm gonna fold this over so it's not going on the inside, although it's fine if it does. Again, I'm not, I'm just pressing. I'm not rubbing, I'm not mixing it up. I wanna let the alcohol do its thing. Okay, so I'm just pressing, pressing on it, making sure it's nice and tight. Then right here, I'm gonna fold it over and do some more here. Okay, let's get to set that one aside for a minute. And grab some more. This one sheet should be enough for us. So again, we're gonna do the same thing with the same colors so it looks like we did not add this piece. So I have some of that red, some green, purple, yeah, the one, the one, the woman I saw that did a video on this, she did it on a like a porcelain planter pot, and it was, I loved it. I was immediately like, oh my gosh, I have to try this. I don't have a porcelain pot, um, so I thought I'm gonna go to the shed and see what I got out there. So, the bowl I use is just an old bowl that we no longer use, and this vase we had for a while as well. Or actually, the vase we didn't have for a while. We've, it was just. Um, given to us by somebody a while ago. All right, so we have a good amount there. All right, so now I'm gonna take my vase. Again, this is the part I want to put the alcohol ink on, so I'm gonna put this down here and then wrap it. Okay, just like that. Fold this over. And you can have it go in the vase as well if you want to. But I think I'm okay just like this. Okay, so again, I'm not um, pushing on it. Well, I'm pushing on it, but I'm not rubbing it. Okay, you can see some parts here I don't have the ink on. That's completely fine. Just patting it on there, making sure everything's nice and tight against that vase. Okay, then you want to let this sit. It is. 8.30 in the morning. 
I'll come back maybe in like eight hours and we'll try it, see what it looks like. Okay. Isn't that a fun technique though? So I'll come back in eight hours and I'll see, we'll see what it looks like. So I'll see you guys soon. All right, friends, we are back. It's been close to 10 hours since we alcohol inked our vase. We're now going to take the saran wrap off of there. All righty, here we go. Oh, I'm liking it. That is really, really cool looking. What do you think? Isn't that pretty? That is really, really nice. I love the variations of colors. We have like some smears here, almost like a leaf form there. Really, really pretty. I'm not sure if the light's gonna do this justice or not, but it is absolutely gorgeous. And I love that we can still see the original color of the vase behind it. It kind of just blends in nicely. That is really, really pretty. I will have a picture of this at the very end of this video so you can see it better. I'll take a picture outside so you can see it. But it is so nice. I would definitely let it air out because when I took that off, you do have the alcohol fumes and the alcohol ink. But very, very pretty. And just very simple, right? Saran wrap or plastic wrap, some alcohol ink all over it without spreading it, without blending it, without applying any kind of alcohol or a blending solution. Just apply it on there. Let it sit for a couple hours and you are good to go. Love that. So there's that side there. I love this, how it's nice and bold. Even got the bottom. Very, very pretty. All right, my friends, there you have it. Playing with alcohol inks, applying it with a vase or to a vase using a saran wrap. Um, any questions at all, please let me know. As always, thanks so much for watching. Have a great day, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.